some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we find ourselves in Charlotte, North Carolina with a frauditor who is, well, not that bright. He's not exactly the sharpest knife in the drawer or whatever other metaphor you prefer to use. At any rate, he goes to a uh, police station to get a FOIA request, but is denied. Now he wants to file complaints. Oh my, oh my. Go ahead and cry me a river of tears and build a bridge over it, you bloody moron. And while he does that, we can all sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. There we go. The Providence Division again. Hello. <laughs> I'd like to make a couple of public records requests. Uh, where are you? I need um, names and ID numbers and salaries of all the officers assigned to this station. Now, what the hell are you going to do with that kind of information anyway? Because you know what? From what I've seen, you guys never even utilize it anyway, if you ever get it at all. I guess it's just that he wants to become just like Goat Boy. Oh yeah, that's probably it. He just wants to be a Goat Boy bootlicker and supply his goats with food. Oh yeah, you just can't let those Goats go hungry. I mean, Goat Boy has been feeding them enough lately. And a letter of agreement with the post office down the road to enforce laws on their property. Okay, um, the way we do it is I make the request to you and you forward it to them. Um, I can make a verbal request with you and you forward it to them, whoever can fulfill the request. Oh my goodness, it looks like you're also modeling Goat Boy's attitude issues. You must be one of his biggest fans on the internet. So, which makes you quite a sad and pathetic little individual, my friend. Because, you know what, there are better people to model your uh, own personality after. And he is not one of them. But that's not how I am taught to do it here. So. That's the way the law says to do it. That's the best I can do for you. Okay, can I get your name and ID number? My number is 6372. 6372. And yeah. your name? Yeah, all I need is your name. Okay. Well, dude, it's time for you to go fill out a complaint form on these people. But you know what? I don't think it'll go very far because you know what? You've been known to do well audits on the local post offices, and that's not exactly a popular issue right now. So you know what you can do? You can go find Joey's surreal camera and join him in the ambulance because you know what? He was just recently trespassed from every single library in Pima County, Arizona. So yeah, you two can share a ambulance and uh, enjoy the butter cream. Take care. I'll be making a complaint. Well, there you go. He doesn't want to follow the law. So I'll make a phone call to them. See about getting that. Even though he's supposed to forward it to them. I bet I call them. I bet they'll tell me I have to put it in writing. And on their online form to do it, it says the law, it actually says on there, the law says it does not have to be in writing. It can be verbal.
Uh, we've been here before. Well, at least it was short, sweet, and to the point. No arguing, nothing about that nature. And let that be a lesson to you, dude. Don't act like a jackass frauditor like you have been doing, and maybe you'll get some service. At any rate, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and I will see you on the next one.